Vertical landscaping, real and artificial. Amidst extensive urbanization and increasing number of high-rise structures city dwellers are realizing the importance of green spaces. People are shifting their focus towards outdoor living. Those who have terraces are turning it into beautiful terrace gardens to have their own green space. People who have space crunch are giving due attention to their balconies to have small cozy green corners. As terrace garden designers in Delhi we firmly believe that vertical landscaping has become one of the hottest trend and element of terrace or balcony garden. As the name suggests vertical gardens are green walls, gardening on a vertical surface. Why vertical landscaping? Green spaces are always pleasing to the eyes. When architects and terrace garden designers combine properly curated horizontal landscaping, hardscape and softscape with vertical gardens then the entire site becomes all the more attractive. Vertical green walls not only adds to the green element but also tend to become a highlighting feature of the entire space. Vertical landscaping has become one of hottest trend in garden designing in Delhi. Green walls are an attractive alternative to the outdoor cladding finishes as it infuses life into the barren and dead walls. One can incorporate a green wall to disguise an unattractive view. Green walls also make way for private screening from the neighboring houses. An added advantage of a vertical green wall is that it can be set up on any wall, whether it's a boundary wall or a small balcony wall. Real and artificial vertical landscaping. You can opt in for both real and artificial green walls. For a total maintenance fuss-free arrangement artificial green panels are a suitable option. These green panels come in different textures, appearance and density. It can either be a simple green panel or with added artificial colorful flowers. Artificial vertical green panels are supported on a structure of welded wire or a bamboo mesh. For nature lovers, real vertical landscaping would sound an ideal option. Setting up a real green wall can be as easy as growing a few climbers along a trellis or a post. However, for a proper green wall installation of iron structure framework is required. Plants are grown in small plastic pocket planters which are further screwed to the framework. The advantage here is that these individual planters can be easily removed and rearranged. In such a way a dense hedge of green plants can be created. When it comes to choosing the correct types of plants for the pocket planters one should opt for the evergreen ones. Evergreen plants keep their leaves whole year around thereby giving a solid green structure to your garden. Flowering plants look appealing only in the blooming season whereas as the evergreen ones maintains the green element of your terrace garden whole year long. There are a lot of evergreen climbers like bougainvillea, Chinese honeysuckle or rangoon, Hindi name, madumal tea, vine or jasmine. Maintenance. Maintenance of vertical garden doesn't take much of an effort. In case of artificial vertical landscaping there is no maintenance that needs to be done. If the green panel are UV protected then it won't lose its color. However real plants do require certain amount of watering. Manual watering is the usual technique. Another prominent watering technique is drip irrigation system wherein water is allowed to slowly drip to the roots or close to the soil surface through a well-defined system of valves, pipes and emitters. This technique hassle-free and allows for less wastage of water.